Hi YouTube, this is Naked iDrive, and today I'm gonna to go over some of the best practices for managing your BMR device. These are some of the routine maintenance tasks that you will want to perform generally over the lifetime of your device. First, let's go over the reporting tools. From the main menu, click Settings, Mail, to configure your email server settings. Choose your preferred email delivery service from the drop-down. Fill in the form, and whenever you make changes to the email settings here, make sure to send yourself a test email at the end to ensure your settings are correct. And when you're done, click Save. Next, navigate over to the Logs page. Here you can configure the recipients of notifications as well as what conditions will trigger a notification. We recommend setting at least one email address here. Next, we want to choose what events will trigger a notification. Successful events, failure events, or all events. We recommend leaving it at all until you've tested that your backups are working properly. The log level field below indicates how much information will be included in your emails. The more severe the log level, the less information will be returned, but we recommend leaving it at it. When you're done, click Save. Next, click System Health from the main menu. We recommend checking out this page periodically to ensure your disk usage remains optimal. Aim to keep your total disk usage less than about 85% of the total volume. You can also further support this goal by changing the policy for the number of backups kept in the settings page. You go to settings, image backups. You can change the maximum number for both incremental backups as well as the maximum number for full image backups. And when you're satisfied, click save. Going back to the system health page, you should also periodically check for both the, that the RAID and the disk health is good on the system. The status field of all your devices below should be green to indicate that they are operating in correct order. Finally, it's worth pointing out here that the backup size of each client is not equal to the amount of space it will take up on the device due to our use of deep data deduplication and compression. In some of our testing scenarios, we've been able to back up around 40 terabytes of raw data to a single 6 terabyte BMR device. The amount of the device is also how much space it will take when it is pushed up to the cloud, further saving you the amount of space you will need on your iDrive account. That wraps up our tutorial for the day. For any questions, don't hesitate to leave them in the comments or by visiting us online at www.idrive.com.